And good evening. Thank you very much for being with us. And first time, two hundreds of students walk out of class to protest a major overhaul of Portland schools. Last night, the district announced a plan to close one high school and change the way others educate. K2 Susan Harding is live at Benson High School. And Susan, students are pretty unhappy that Benson will go from a four year school to a two year specialized academy. That's right. And just a second ago, we heard some yelling from one of the windows, people yelling, save our school. They are disappointed. They are frustrated, but they promised to fight for their school. They said they heard the superintendent's message last night, but today it's time for her to hear theirs. Just before students walked out, a message in the windows. Why ruin the school? A message shared by the hundreds. who chose to ditch one afternoon class to save Benson's 90-year tradition as a four-year school. It's hard, and it was heartbreaking, literally. I don't know why they would try to change a school that actually works. The freshmen and sophomores know the plan will mean commuting between a neighborhood school and Benson. I don't see a lot of people going to even try to come to Benson because it's just going to be hectic going to two schools and figuring everything out. People who are here want to be here. They're not forced to come here like they are a neighborhood school. Benson's principal supervised the walkout. They're delivering a big message and they are respectful and uh, orderly and they got the right to deliver their message and they took advantage of it. Even teachers have been saying, like, I want to go to the walkout, but I'm afraid I might lose my job. One teacher did speak out, accusing the school board of targeting minority students. Maybe some people on the school board or governments really don't want to see some minorities do well, and I think that's really the driving force behind it. The students here include seniors, who say they're not here for themselves, but for Benson's legacy. Yes, my dad did go here. He went through the auto body program, and he's an auto body man now. He actually ran his own business for a while. After an hour outside, the rains came down, ending the walkout, but they hope not the message. A few students told me they really didn't think the walkout was going to change anything, so they hope that supporters will write letters and also go to district meetings before that June 21st vote. Live at Benson High School, Susan Harding, K2 News.